Hello friends, welcome to English Ka Gyan, Chintan Ke Saath and today we are going to discuss these two words with meaning and with sentences likewise we do on every weekend. So without wasting any time, let's start the discussion about the same. So the word number 95 and if I talk about the word itself, then it is assertive. If I talk about the category of this particular word, then it is adjective. And if I talk about the meaning of this particular word, then you can either consider as a positive or you can consider confident, means assertive. So it means that whenever we use either positive or confident word in our day-to-day -day communication, those words can be replaced with assertive word. It means, let's say, for example, confident personality, confident teacher, right? Confident individual, confident software developer, confident uh, doctor. So all those, in all those contexts, the assertive word can be utilized in a way like assertive student, assertive teacher, assertive software engineer, assertive, um, what I can say, the educator, assertive chief minister or something like that, right? So assertive means either positive or confident you can consider. Right. So now let me go to the first sentence in which like I have utilized the word assertive and let's try to understand the context in which the word can be utilized. OK, the first sentence is is like assertive global leaders can contribute in solving problems. Like poverty, girl child education and global warming across the world. See, whatever the problems that I have mentioned, these are the problems not only of one particular country, they are the global problems like poverty, like culture, education, global warming, all these problems are of like are of entire world. And for that, the 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 work from global leaders, the, the work from assertive global leaders is required the work from confident global leaders will be required to solve all these kind of problems so that those assertive global leader will like will do some work to bring all the countries together and try to solve all these kind of problems um, from the world so for that the confident global leader is required to solve all these kind of problems the positive global leader is required to solve all these kind of problems. So instead of using confident global leader, instead of using positive global leader, I have utilized the word assertive because it has the same meaning and in the same context, the word can be utilized. So I hope that the word and the meaning of this assertive word and the context in which the word can be utilized, you guys understood, right? Now let me go to the second sentence in which again I have tried to use the assertive one word with some different meaning or what I can say in some different context. Okay, and the sentence is assertive educators. Educators means simply you can consider as a teachers. Assertive teachers can make significant changes in the society by educating poor segment of the same or poor segment of the society assertive educators means assertive teacher confident teachers can make significant changes in the society by educating the poor segment of the society it means by by educating the poor people right there will be drastic change in the society society will become more sensible so many problems will automatically solved if the people will get proper education and to initiate this kind of initiatives the educators has to be assertive the teachers has to be confident the teachers has to be positive right because in in doing in providing a kind of free education to poor people there will be so many challenges the teachers has to find out the funds the teachers has to find out the proper places where there's like where the poor people come 
and then the education will be given so all those challenges will be there and to solve or by overcoming all those problems and to give the education to this poor society or poor people of the society so if if that is required then the teacher has to be assertive and all those things can be done only by assertive teachers confident teachers confident educators positive educators who are ready to face those challenges and overcome those challenges to educate the people in the society and to bring some significant changes in the society so instead of using confident teachers instead of using positive teachers i have utilized the word assertive because it has the same meaning right now let me go to the uh, news headline or the article in which i have seen this particular word uh, this is the headline in which uh, there was a statement from the cops or from the police department and they are talking they, they probably uh, they were talking about some activity uh, like for stopping the illegal scooters or something like that and the sentence is something like that the the portion that we need to focus is cops needs to be more assertive in stopping the activities of illegal scooter that is what the main meaning that we need to focus in this headline it means the police men need to be more confident or need to be more assertive okay to stop the activities of illegal scooters they need to be more confident then and then they will face or they will attack or they will prevent those kind of activities from being happen so in that context the word assertive has been utilized in this particular sentence they need to be the cops need to be more confident so instead of using word confident they have utilized the word assertive they need to be more assertive in terms of catching those individuals who are doing or who are involved in those kind of illegal activities right so now i hope you understand the meaning in which the assertive word can be utilized now let's go to the another word and the word number is 96 if i talk about the category of the word then it is in, indispensable uh, the word is indispensable the category is adjective and the meaning of this particular word is absolute necessary when you talk something about absolute necessary right so for that kind of thing the indispensable word can be utilized it means if in in a very simple way if i say then whenever you guys use necessary word like necessary lights necessary food so in all those contexts the necessary word can be replaced with the indispensable word necessary programming languages to develop certain softwares right necessary machineries to to do certain kind of operations so instead of using necessary word there you can also utilize word indispensable right now let's go to uh, the first sentence which i have created by using this indispensable word and the sentence is it is indispensable for the world population to preserve energy resources it is necessary for the world population to preserve in energy resources otherwise in near future we are going to face problems in terms of accessing those energy resources and then we realize that okay if we have saved them if we have preserved them then i think to, uh, we are like uh, then i think uh, it was good for us so if we really want that that particular kind of situation not happen with us then in that case it is really necessary for the world population to preserve energy sources like petrol and whatever the other gases are all those things who are consumed by us in a, in a in a very large quantity on a daily basis so it is really necessary for us to preserve them so instead of using it is necessary for the world population i have utilized the word it is indispensable for the world population to preserve those kind of energy 
resources. So I hope you understand the meaning. And uh, now let's go to the second sentence. And the second sentence is something like this. And like using technology is indispensable in today's modern world. Because see, um, like everybody has to walk or everybody has to uh, upgrade his or herself based on the time right and right now we are living in the contemporary world we are living in the modern world where using technology is absolute necessary for us why because it will also save our time it will also save our efforts which can be utilized in some another way right so using technology is absolute necessary in today's modern world so instead of using necessary word i have utilized the word indispensable over here right now let me go to the news headline in which the same word has been utilized and the headline is something like this canada's oil industry will be indispensable for decades to come see oil industry is is we can consider that particular oil as energy resources and the canada's oil industry will be absolute necessary for the world population in upcoming decades okay so the oil industry of canada will be necessary will become necessary for the world because that is the only source that will be the only source from where we are going to get the larger amount of oil for our daily uses so instead of using canada uh, necessary word over there they have utilized the word indispensable and the sentence is something like this which you guys can see from my screen right so i hope you get the idea in which context both these words can be utilized okay we will meet next weekend with more words with more categories and with more sentences till then be happy and if you really feel that you have learned something something from my video then please do not forget to like share and subscribe to my channel for getting regular updates we will meet next weekend with more words till then be happy goodbye